In this session, we will look at concepts to consider when conducting qualitative research, such as validity and reliability. Reliability, validity, generalizability, and replicability. Do they apply to qualitative research? Well, these four concepts are always at the forefront of any discussion about research methods and need some consideration here. So first, let's take a look at reliability. Bryman notes that there are three ways in which we talk about reliability. So reliability usually refers to how consistently your data is measured. So would you be able to get the same results if you repeated your study? It can also refer to whether or not the indicators that are used in the scales are consistent. Now this is often referred to as internal reliability. And finally, inter-observer consistency is where we can be sure that one person observed is what another person would also observe in that situation. Validity may appear similar to reliability, but there are some differences. Bryman notes that there are five ways in which the term is used, but that they all address the issue of the extent to which the measure accurately reflects what you are trying to address in your research. One concept is generalizability. Now it's quite simply where we can expect that the findings of our research can be generalised to a wider population than those we studied. The fourth concept is replicability and it's more commonly associated with scientific experiments. So let's suppose that a chemist has formulated a hypothesis that putting X and Y together will produce Z. The first time it's tried the result is Z and then, no matter how many times it's replicated, the answer is consistently Z. This means that we can predict that X plus Y equals Z. In terms of the social research, the question then is, can a study be replicated in the same way? It is this latter point that tends to cause the greatest problems for qualitative research. However, we also have to think if criteria derived from both the natural sciences and quantitative methods are the most appropriate yardsticks for the qualitative research, which often seeks out subjective meanings as data. One approach put forward by Lincoln and Guber is to think in terms of trustworthiness, which consists of four elements. So the four concepts are credibility, transferability, dependability and confirmability, as put forward by Lincoln and Guber, to determine the trustworthiness. This can then be considered to determine if a study can be replicated.